Hey guys, welcome to I Just Want to Open Things. My name is Rick, and today we are going to be opening a ton of Marvel Tsum Tsums. Let's get started. So if you've watched this video, you know that we already opened some of these Marvel Tsum Tsums, and because I wanted to open some more with you guys, I went ahead and got some more three packs, as well as a bunch of the blind bags, and we got the limited edition Captain America Classic, and I found out about that from Lauren Murphy who posted a comment about it after the first opening video. With us again is the tiny, tiny pocket knife that I got, because none of these bags have openings of their own. We're going to have to go ahead and cut them with the tiny knife. Oh, looks like the first one we got is a double. Now let's take a look really fast at what's available on this bag that I just opened. We don't have the Rocket Raccoon, although I did get the tiny Rocket Raccoon in one of the three packs. We got Captain America, we don't have Falcon, Ghost Rider, Hobgoblin, Thor. We've only gotten five of these and there are 10 available. It's a 50-50 chance whether we're gonna open something we've opened before. And the first one, we have already opened. So these two pieces click together to create the giant Iron Man Repulsor Ray hand. And then we have the Iron Man Zoom Zoom with all of his little pieces and parts and his little chest repulsor ray. Captain America's is really cool because he comes with this separate shield that you can either put on his back or actually affix to the front of the display that he sits on. We put it on the display on that one, so I'm gonna go ahead and set it on his back on this one, just for a little variety. So put that there, set him on top of it, and now where shall we put him? We'll put him there between the two larger Captain Americas. Four more packs to open. I am hoping that this will be where our luck changes. And it is not. This one is Spider-Man, and he comes with a little piece that you add to his base as well, but unlike Captain America, you can't stick it on his back, unfortunately. But he sits here atop his little tower that apparently he's created with his own webbing. Oh no. Yep, so here is Captain America number three. I'm gonna go ahead and set him down over here next to the other Captain America. Two packs to go, no new Zoom Zooms yet. Hey, all right, finally. One we haven't seen yet, and it's the Hobgoblin. So this is really, really cool. This guy is actually uh, five different pieces, If you well, four if you don't count the actual figure, but it's the pumpkin, and the lid either sits on the pumpkin, or you open the pumpkin, you set this up, so it's like a uh, plume of green smoke that's coming out of the pumpkin, this guy, the Hobgoblin, sits inside here on the bottom of the smoke, and then there's a space here for the smaller Hobgoblin, and then the pumpkin lid actually has a, a tiny little piece here, so you can set the smaller Zoom Zoom down, and then put this on top of the smaller one, which is super duper awesome. That is the first of five that we've opened that we had not already seen. We're still looking for Rocket Raccoon, the Falcon, Ghost Rider, and Thor. Ah, it wasn't a great week for getting new toys, um, but we did get a bunch of really cool doubles. So this is the third vision that we've gotten, um, and the fifth double that we've gotten today. Um, the vision's cool, I like him. I like the uh, toy too. I like the way that they made it look like he's passing through a solid wall like that. But wait, there's more because we've still got all these guys in the background to open, and I want you guys to take a look at this really weird artwork I have behind these guys. So let's go ahead and open these guys up so that you can see the craziness that's happening back there. Ant-Man is the one character that makes the most sense to have in all three sizes. I don't know if my tiny knife is gonna do it, but we're gonna find out together. Nope. Nope, looks like the tiny knife isn't gonna do it. I'm gonna have to get something a little more rugged to take care of this plastic. We've got the large Black Widow. She's got her little uh, stun batons and her little Black Widow logo and her Black Widow belt and her Black Widow hair, just like all Black Widows in the wild have. Next up is Iron Man, who is, as far as I can tell, no different from the Iron Man that comes with the hand, except for that he does not come with a hand. Ant-Man! There he is, the tiny, tiny little Ant-Man 
no bigger than a rocket raccoon. He's got the little tiny antennas, they're so small. Very cool, small little ant man. And now you guys can see more of the artwork back there. It is actually Marvel superheroes and villains made out of donuts. This is something that I picked up at WonderCon two years ago, I think. My biggest question, because I hadn't seen one of the larger or smaller Captain Americas was, will his shield still come off? And let's find out. Doesn't seem like his shield will come off. I'm not gonna pull any harder than that um, because I don't wanna break him. I'm gonna take one of these Captain Americas and put him up here just to see how that works. I would think that they would wanna make the shield removable because it doesn't seem like you can really put the stand from this Captain America onto the shield, but I just don't wanna wreck it. Well, you know, I've got two of them, so maybe I'll pull a little bit harder on this guy. Now, I'm looking, it looks like there's glue down there. I'm pretty sure that that is just a permanently affixed shield. Yeah, he doesn't wanna stay up there. That works out great because these guys are actually a little bit too round sometimes for these to stand on top of each other. This makes a delightful platform for the second Captain America, and I assume the smaller Captain America that goes above that. Here's the medium-sized Ant-Man. He's just like the small Ant-Man, which is right here except he is medium sized. And now we'll take a look at the tiny, tiny Falcon with his little tiny wings. This is the comic book Falcon and not the movie Falcon because he's got the old school wings. He doesn't have the metal wings. He doesn't wear the goggles. He's got the mask, but he's got the little tiny gloves. Finally, we have this, which is the Captain America limited edition set. It actually has uh, the large sizes of a lot of the Tsum Tsums you can get in other packs, but it also has the Captain America Classic, which has a different color and a different shield. Here is the big Captain America, which we've already seen, and his shield does not come off. So do not try to take his shield off. It will be a bad day. Here's the big Falcon. Here's the tiny Falcon. These are the Falcon wings from the Falcon in the comic book, as well as the cool mask. He's got this weird beak thing on the top of his mask, which is strange. Maybe like if you did like this. There you go. Actually, now he looks more like an owl. Winter Soldier. And <laughs> I really, I hadn't seen him before. I hadn't really looked at his, his uh, figure in the package, but he's got to have the metal arm and it looks like they built it partially into his body which, you know, I mean, it would have been difficult to put the whole metal arm deal with the star and everything there on that tiny little nub of a hand. All right, here is Black Widow, who we've already seen. Batons, Widow Marks, belt, hair. Nick Fury. I really dig these scars. That is cool. And then finally, classic Captain America. Let's do a side-by-side -side comparison. It looks like the differences are the color. This Captain America has no belt. This Captain America does have a belt. This Captain America has a more modern ear wing, or this Captain America has a more traditional wing-shaped ear wing. So Captain America's shield didn't used to be round. It used to be this type of shape. And I don't think that he used to be able to throw it. So there is my current Tsum Tsum collection. As you can see, I have an overabundance of Captain Americas and quite a few other figures. But that is totally fine because now I have a bunch of these to give away to you guys. Before we go, I wanted to show you all of the superhero and villain donuts on this print. Do you guys recognize all of these characters? I'd be interested to know if anybody could name every single donut on this entire print. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time. Come on, Vision, we've got to help Cap fight Iron Man. I'm afraid I won't be able to go with you. What? Why not? I seem to have gotten stuck halfway through this wall. But don't worry, the Winter Soldier is with Captain America. I'm sure they'll be fine. All right, Cap, I'm gonna have to ask you to surrender. That's not gonna happen. And besides, you're outnumbered two to one. Oh, I don't know about that. As you can see, I've made some upgrades to my armor. <laughs> oh. War over.